Hello guys and welcome to Till Vacuum Do Us Part and it's exciting because today is Prime Day today and tomorrow. That's why I'm posting this video a day early so you guys weren't missing out. I did want to also let you know that I'm going to have a Prime Day link down below in the description box and we're going to update that as the day goes. So anytime you want to see any of the major deals happening, click on that. Like I said, we're going to keep updating it as Amazon updates their Prime Day sales. So definitely make sure to check that out. I'm also also going to be doing giveaways over on Instagram just because it's easier to send money out there quickly because we can like DM. So if you want to be a part of that, make sure you're following Till Vacuum Do Us Part over there. And my husband, which is Dill Chaser for you, I'm going to have all those links and information down below in the description box. But now let's get started talking about these amazing products I have to share with you today. I think the very first thing we're gonna start off with is my shirt. I feel like I finally found the best t-shirt ever and I liked them so much, I bought a ton. So I bought every neutral color option available. I was totally influenced by someone over um, on Instagram. It's like Burnett blog. I don't know, I'll link her down below, but she always has good finds. She had me at best tea ever and I was like sold. I wanna try it. It's like that buttery soft material. Um, so I got them in two sizes. I got smalls and medium in every color because I love the small. Um, I have it on with like jeans today. I'll show some like pictures. I can throw this on with shorts, but I also grabbed the mediums. So when it starts to cool off here, like in the fall and winter, it's a little bit longer in the back so I can wear it with leggings. I think I could have done it with like the small anyways, technically, cause like it goes down a little bit. So you definitely do not have to size up with this. If you want it to fit a little bit tighter, you could size down, but I feel like just the size you normally wear is the perfect size. Like that's how it's gonna fit you best. But like I said, sometimes I always call myself a medium cause like I'm a small, I'm a medium. So I bought both, I'm happy with both. If you're gonna be wearing it with like jeans and shorts, I definitely do the smaller size. But if you're wanting it for like leggings, maybe go up the size. Um, like I said, they have different colors, but I grabbed the black, I grabbed like the tan or the mocha. And then obviously a good basic white is always good to have. I feel like it's such a classic look. It's just like clean and crisp. Um, I can even link my shoes because they're on Amazon as well. I've been getting a ton of comments about those over on Instagram, but I feel like starting out with clothes is just fun. It's basic. You can dress this up and down so many different ways. Throw it on with a blazer, throw it on with like comfy shorts. You can work out in it. I love a good basic that you can just take from like day to night. I could put on a really cute necklace with this. I don't know, I'm just sold. Super comfortable, they wash and dry up really well. I think I've been hang drying mine, but they are oversized, so you could probably dry them and be fine. While we're on the subject of clothes, and I do wanna tell you, I have like beauty, I have outdoor stuff, I have like kitchen stuff, electronics, so you're gonna see a little bit of everything in this video, but Chase kept finding these good deals over on Deal Chaser for pajama sets, and I've never really owned pajama sets. I always just sleep in like an old comfy t-shirt and like cheerleading shorts from like when I was in college and high school and all the things. So finally I was like, okay, it's a good deal, buy it. And I have several now, a lot of them are in the laundry, the first one I bought is solid black with like white trim and it's more of like a cloth material and I love it. And then I found this one, which was like leopard and it's just really cute. Like, especially if you're going on vacation with family or friends, I feel like it's just a really cute, modest, trendy, but like comfy thing to sleep in. I love, love, love the leopard. This is more of that like silky material. Let me tell you what size. I'm getting mediums in them, just so you know. I definitely don't want like tight pajamas, so I definitely go up since I'm a speedium. <laughs> I do like medium and things I want looser, and then smalls and things I want tighter, and a medium is perfect on this. Like I said, they have so many different like designs and colors, and you can normally find a really good deal on them. So that's something to not forget about if you're needing to update your pajamas. I know it can be hard because like we don't want to spend a ton of money on pajamas, but sometimes you just need them. This is definitely the way to go. 
Now we're in the bathroom, so that means we're gonna be talking about some beauty products for in here. Um, Savannah is my skin guru, beauty, all the things. I just never knew much growing up, and I swear she's the one keeping me so young. Um, and she is always so excited to try out new products and new things. She's also super, super sensitive, so if you have a sensitive like child, or maybe you have sensitive skin, definitely follow here because she gives me all the knowledge and all the things. Um, but basically she loved the line. It's called like Drunk Elephant. And if you have like a teenager in your house, you probably already know what that means. They have the coolest like packaging. It's like neon, but it is so expensive. Like I'm talking for something like smaller than this. It's like $90. But the main reason she wanted it is because all their like lotions and creams and stuff like that come in this container where you like push down on it, it pops up and then you put it on. It's just like a fun way to apply it. You can mix different things on it. Um, so she found these on Amazon and was like, mom, I really don't want drunk elephant. I just want the container. And it comes in a two pack. She's already been using one of them. I told her I would take this one to show you on camera how it works. Um, it even comes with like a little spoon or spatula. Like, so if you need to scrape out your bottle and put it into this one. Um, and then she did open it up at one point because I'm like, how does this actually get it to the top and it like sucks the whole thing it's gonna be really hard to tell on here up so like all her product was up here so it's some type of system but it works she loves it i'm excited to use it so i'm gonna go and put my product in it i'll show you what she uses but i feel like this is a really cool gift to yourself or if you have that preteen teenager daughter in your life that's like all into skincare i feel like it's just that generation this is a really cool affordable gift for them I wanted to show you the container up close just real quick so you could kind of see. It just has a lid that pops on and off and then you just take that lid off. Now this is like what my daughter swears by. Like I said, she's got sensitive skin. She always has to be like super duper careful. She loves this stuff. So if you're looking for something, I can link this as well because I think it's on Amazon. Um, she got me started on this and I love it. I know it can be used all over your body, but I just feel like I've been drier this season than most. Um, so I picked up this and I love it. Like I said, I use it all over like my face, neck and shoulders. If I have any left over, I will rub it like on my hands or elbows, but I do use this on my face and love it. So basically I'm just gonna fill this up with this and then it's gonna look way nicer. This could even set out on my counter, whereas I would never put this on my counter. My product's getting low, which I didn't even realize until I started this video. Oh, it's not, it's just kind of messed up. But I did wanna show you that they do come with these, like I could just call it like a tiny little spatula. So you don't have to waste any product because no one wants to be wasting any skincare products. They can be so expensive. So that way you can just like scrape it and bring everything in. So nothing has to be left over or wasted. So I love that it comes with um, two of them because the um, link that I'm gonna send you is gonna send you two of these containers. I did wanna show you real quick, it does come with like the little spatula thing so you don't have to waste any product. The last thing you wanna do is waste your expensive product that you're putting over into a different container. So I feel like that's super nice that they threw that in. It comes with two of them because the link I'm gonna give you comes with two of these containers. So if you have two different products or you just wanna buy one and share it with a friend or share it with a daughter, you can do that. But I have my product in there. I'm going to spin it shut. Like I said, there's a lid for it if you need it. Now the first couple times, or the first time, oh, I was gonna tell you it was gonna take a little bit to get it started, but it didn't. So all you do is push down on it and then you have that perfect amount of product that you need. So if you need one pump, two pump, you know exactly what you're getting. Um, I feel like with this pump, I was getting too much every time. So I honestly think this is gonna help me like extend the life of my product because I can get less with every push. 
Now the next product we're gonna talk about is a makeup bag, which I have to be really impressed by a makeup bag to <laughs> share it here on my like Amazon favorites because a makeup bag is just a makeup bag, right? Like unless it's super cool or has something fancy about it, it's like just get one that you like. Get the size you need, get the print you need, whatever. But I kept seeing this one like all over the place. I kept seeing it all over Instagram. Um, I kept seeing reels on it. I don't have like TikTok or anything, but I'm sure it's over there. But basically what's cool about this is it's the way it opens. Now, let me talk about like the look of it first. I love, love, love the look of it. It looks super high end. It looks like a designer bag. Um, I love the print on it. Obviously it comes in different colors. I chose like this light cream because um, a lot of my like travel luggage looks like this or is this color um full disclaimer i don't use a makeup bag during um like during the week like when i'm home and i'm here i have a drawer but anytime i travel or go anywhere obviously i need one i know a lot of people though have everything in a makeup bag like my mom has a makeup bag and she gets ready like on her sofa every day i had a makeup bag growing up and i would sit down on the floor in front of a mirror like a little walmart <laughs> standing mirror and get ready so if you have makeup bags or you do travel this is definitely one to check out um, but I'll show you what makes it so cool. I wanted to get the camera closer so you could see when I open this. So right now it looks like a normal makeup bag. Like it's just got that one flat surface. Um, but when you actually unzip it, it like opens up so big and has like different sections. So basically you're gonna have a zipper here. You're gonna have two sections here, a pocket, plus this middle opens up. But typically on a normal bag, you would just have this one surface and everything would be crammed and full, or it would be one of those really deep makeup bags that you can never find anything because it's like all the way at the bottom. I love this, like opens up and you can see everything and it's even gonna do better when it's not like brand new. I'm gonna put my products in here just so you can get a visual of like what it looks like and I can like open it and close it for you. But already I think it's like a really cool <laughs> invention that someone gave came up with. Okay, so here it is. You can tell it's like closed up. It's cute. It still has the little handle. Let me like set down the camera so I can open it up for you right here. And when you open it up, it just opens and where I put everything, it's in there. So it did not get mixed up. So once it closes, it keeps everything where you need it. And then you can see everything. Let me set this down, <laughs> I have two hands. But that is so nice and convenient to have. So this will definitely be packed on every vacation, every dance trip we go to. Um, plus I just like the way it looks. And I also like that this inside isn't material. It's just easy to wipe off. So if you need to spray anything in there and clean it out in between trips, or you know, if you carry this every single day and you need to clean it out, it's going to be easy to clean as well. Okay, I have one more product I wanna talk about here in the bathroom and then we'll be moving on to the next category. But I was searching bathroom stuff. I'm always searching Amazon just in general, trying to find like gadgets or products that just solve problems. It's not like useless stuff we don't need. It's like it really will make something easier or work better or function better or just save you time during the day. And this is one that I actually kind of got for Chase because he has to clean out all of our drains. So Savannah has really long hair and thick hair. I have long hair um, and he's always having to like clean out the drains from, you actually get quite a few of these, um, in our shower or bathtubs. So I picked these up and it tells you how to use them. All you do is like dry it out and stick it on. And then you just peel this off and change that ever so often. But it's a little sticky grid and it goes right over your drain and it's a pretty good size. So it should be pretty standard, like one size fits all. And then that way stuff can get through, like water can get through this, but like your hair, I'm gonna go and like take this off just so you can see. So how it works is you pull off those sticky bottoms and it sticks down over your drain. And then it's got this like clear liner that comes off of it. So once this is stuck on your drain, which I'm gonna show here in a second, 
than this little nettings here. So water can get through, um, but like your hair's not gonna get through that, then it's easy to clean, or it has these little like tabs at the end. You just peel it up, throw it away, and put a new one in because it comes with several. I'll tell you how many here in a second when I look it up, but really cool invention, really affordable, and it's gonna save your drains from like getting clogged or your husband or you having to clean them. So I feel like it's one of those things, it's like a must have if you don't wanna clean your drains all the time because it's going to help the longevity of like your pipes, which is something that you don't want clogged, you don't wanna be hiring plumbers, just get a few of these. We are going to head into my shower. I've looked it up and it's a 50 pack that it comes with. So you will not have to replace this for a while. So I was in here not too long ago, so I'm gonna dry this out so that it's not wet at all. I always think this is so funny. Our builder used this in our last house too, but our drain is tiny little feet. Can you see that? <laughs> it's so funny. Okay, so it's nice and dry. Now I'm gonna put the camera down so I can stick it down and show you how it works. To be honest, you don't really notice it. If I look real close, I can see like the netting or the grid, but it still doesn't bother me. That's gonna save so much hair from going down there. Like I said, I just have such long hair and I've been losing it like crazy lately. <laughs> um, so this is gonna be really helpful. And then once it's full, all you have to do is come in here and like peel this off and then you can replace it um, with a new one. I probably shouldn't have done that. There we go. Good as new. Now let's talk about kind of electronics, <laughs> we're gonna kind of go into that. So these are products I had in the last house and I loved, but they got left there and I didn't think I was gonna replace them. And then after being here a few weeks, it was like, okay, Chase, get those orders. <laughs> I definitely need them. So I love anytime I can just plug these into, you know, like already an outlet. And this one actually screws in, so it's gonna make sure it's even really tight. But I had this in my office at the last house and it was so nice, I could charge multiple batteries batteries at the same time. I could charge stuff. I could plug stuff in. It's just got so many different like attachments to it. And then another one that I used a lot was this one. And I use this in my guest bedroom because once again, like it gives you an extra outlet, but I love that you can plug phone chargers into there. So you can have them all set up when guests come. To me, I love the three because when my two nieces come in town, Savannah stays in there with them and I can plug in them each a cord. They can all charge their phone. I just get like a really long cord, plug it in and they're good to go. And I can move this around. So if we're gonna be in the living room or the dining room or they're going outside, I just unplug this, it already has the cords attached. I plug it in and then they can all have a way to charge their phones or whatever you're needing. But these were two products that I've had before, I've shared before, I love them, I even reordered them. So I just wanted to share them again with you. Now this next product, you're either gonna love and be like, oh my gosh, I'm gonna use that, or you're gonna be like, that's crazy, why would you ever need that? So <laughs> basically, Savannah helps um, teach at her dance studio a lot. And obviously she has younger ones and smaller ones and they always have to take turns like guarding the light switch because there's little kids and they love to run over there and turn them off and then everybody screams and then you have to calm down all the kids just so you can get back to dance class. And so I was searching Amazon and I actually found, it's called a light switch guard, but basically you screw this on your light switch plate, which I'll show you. And then this opens and closes. So this is really good um, if you're a studio owner or if you just have kids in the house and they're constantly like turning your lights on and off or maybe you have that one switch in your house that you don't want turned off. Maybe there's two different locations for it and you don't want it touched. Maybe it opens a garage. Maybe it's like an important one and you're like, hey, I don't want anyone to touch this one or I want them to be aware. You may have like a sticky note over it. I've seen that before. What's so nice is you can get this, just screw it onto your plate and then it looks nice and then people can't just hit the light switch. They actually have to like unhook it right here and then do it, which is 
kind of nice. It makes you think twice before you do it. And I will say it's like easy to open, but it does take me a second. So it's not like a kid's gonna get it super easy, like get it undone. It comes with screws, I can see them in there. So let's test this out. And then I will be taking this product to the dance studio <laughs> to get those fixed so the dance teachers don't have to worry about it anymore. It takes less than a minute to set up. And like you said, then it's there and then you can open it up. You can still turn it on and off however you need it. And then you just press it in to lock it. And like I said, it doesn't look bad. So I feel like these could be used for a lot of different reasons. Um, so if you need something like that and you don't think I'm crazy right now, <laughs> the link will be down below in the description box. This next item I had in my last house as well. That's how much I love it. I left it for the new owners because it was like attached. Um, but I grew up with one of these in my house. It was in my grandparents' house. I will say it was made differently back in the day. It was like on this nice wood where these are more like plastic now, but it still gets the job done and I love it. Um, it's these easy lid openers. And so you can open up any jar with this. So you just put it underneath a cabinet or underneath a shelf. So I've always had them underneath the shelves in our, our underneath our cabinets in our kitchen, but this would also work if you don't want it out, which you do not see it. Unless you're like looking underneath the cabinets, you do not see this. Um, but you could also put it in your pantry, like underneath a shelf, if you have like wood shelves like I do. Um, and it makes opening jars so easy. I kid you not, Chase was the first one that asked for it. He was here um, working on something and he was like, hey, we don't have like our jar opener because you can even use this for like, you know, other products or you have to open the lids up. It doesn't have to just be for kitchen. So I will say you can hang this two ways or both ways. It has a sticky thing. So if you want to just peel it and stick it, I'm sure that works, but I've never done that. We always screw it in just to make sure it's nice and tight. And then it does have these like sharp like blades right here. And that's what helps you like open the jar. Um, and it makes it so easy. So if you have like um, an older parent or somebody that's like losing their strength or, you know, strength in their hand and it's hard to open, or you're just like me and you can't get the jar open, or maybe you're sending um, your child off to college and you know, they're going to be cooking in their apartment or something. I feel like this is just something that's so affordable and so useful easy to install they'll have it forever you know as long as they're in that place and like i said if you're a renter there is a sticky if you can't um screw into it but let's get this set up in our kitchen so we don't have to worry about it anymore and we have it next time we make spaghetti or something like that so we're going to use both we're going to go ahead and use the sticky so we can get it placed exactly where we want it and then chase can come back in and screw it in so you just stick it there just like that and then like i said we go ahead and use the screws to reinforce it but if you're like renting it's probably not wise you can just use the sticky part that's all it is so like i said you cannot see it like from right here even if you're down low you have to be like down low looking up <laughs> to actually see it I don't know if I've showed you guys my pantry video yet, so I'm gonna be very careful, but you could also put it like underneath a shelf as well if you don't want it out in your kitchen, but you honestly don't see it. And this is right where I'm cooking, so this is where I would need to open it up. But just like that, it's done. Is it only two screws? Uh, three. Three. Bada bing, bada boom. Now I'm gonna show you how it works. I'm just gonna take my Prego can, and all you do is slide it in until it's tight, and then twist. So easy, makes it so easy. It literally makes opening a jar like have zero effort. So like I said, if you know anybody older or just, you know, doesn't have a lot of mobility in their hands or if your kids are home for the summer, you know, teach them how to use it. Like tell them not to cut themselves, but super cool product to have. The next product is inspired by Savannah. Again, you guys know she loves her water bottles. She loves Stanley. We love Simple Modern. 
I don't know, all of them, but um, Chase's aunt came into town from Arizona and she's like our trendy, fun aunt. She was talking about this new water bottle. So Savannah bought it and has been in love with it. I feel like she grabs this almost more often than the other ones now, but it's called a Owala. And so I'm gonna link it. They have all different colors. I would probably buy all black. Savannah grabbed the purple because it's her favorite color. But what she was saying is about the Stanley, they don't love, or her and her friend didn't love that like, it's just a straw, it's open, you know, stuff can get in there. This is like nice and closed off and it locks. So you like open up this first and then it pops open and then you can drink. I think you can like drink, you can suck. And then I think there was one other thing. I'm gonna have to talk to Savannah, but I know there's two, but basically it's like locked in tight. So you'll shut this lid and it snaps and then this locks it in, or you can use this to carry by or to hook on your bike or a backpack. So it's just got a lot of functions. It still works like all the other water bottles where it stays super duper cold. You know, the ice stays in there and doesn't melt. So if you're looking for a little bit more affordable product and you haven't liked the other cups or you're just ready to try something new because that's what we do around here, definitely look into this. Um, I'm gonna have a link down below. This next product was a must have for us here in Oklahoma. If you live in Arizona or California and you don't have any bugs, <laughs> good for you. But here, oh my goodness, anytime you wanna eat outside or have food outside or if you're having a party, there's just bugs. Most of the time we just eat inside and then head out, but there's a lot of the time Savannah and her friends are swimming and they stop for lunch or stop for dinner and they don't wanna come inside where it's like cold with the AC. They just wanna eat outside of the table, but then there's bugs everywhere. So when I saw an ad pop up for this next product, I was like, sold, let's try it, I'm ready. I've been hanging onto it for today and today it's rainy, which means it's rainy, it's chilly, there's no bugs, but I'm gonna test it out inside just to see if the product itself works but let me go grab it here it is mine came as a three pack it may have come in different i don't even remember but i'll link a few for you and you're like okay ashley what is it basically it's a fan but it's a soft fan so it's just enough to keep the flies away from your food so i would set this by my plate or near the food like say i have a bowl of fruit out there i could set this by it because if you ever see someone like live in my area and there's food around, you're just doing this the whole time. Like, cause you're just creating enough wind to keep the flies off your food. Technically there's a lot of times it happens even inside. Like say I'm hosting a party and we're like in and out, in and out, in and out. They come inside. I will literally use these inside too because no one wants flies on their food. I've put like fans out before, but they can be loud and they're like blowing you and they can blow the food. So supposedly this is like the perfect fix. I'll turn on one real fast so we can see. Oh yeah, look at that. Okay, let me set these up so you can see how I'd use them, but that is really cool. I wish I could see if it would actually keep flies away. I'll have to test it another day, because like I said, it's rainy, so there's no flies out there, but it is really cool. This will probably be one of the most used products in my house this summer, and probably not in my house, but outside of my house at the patio table. Um, it's like just enough breeze. Like I said, it keeps bugs away, because like normally we're using our hands, but then you can just eat. Like I said, I just put them in front of the plates or near the plates or around the food um whoever thought of this i know lives somewhere like in the south or oklahoma or somewhere where there's flies and they got so sick of it um i may order a few more just so when we have more people over but um i should have used this during the fourth of july is what i should have done but i was saving it for the video but they work so that's super neat another product i want to talk about is a steamer i feel like at least in my area, I steam way more now. Like all my friends steam, my family steams. We used to iron, but now it's all about steaming. Um, I know I use my steamer a lot because of dance costumes. And so I always have one in my dance bag. <laughs> but this year we had these really weird costumes and like I could not get the wrinkles out. Like I was steaming it and steaming it. It was picture day and I was like, fine, she's just gonna have wrinkles in it. And then another mom let me use her steamer, which was this one. And it was like a miracle worker. And that's when I realized, okay, all steamers are not made alike. So I wanted to share this with you. I just got mine in, like as soon as I used hers, I was like, I have to get that steamer. It makes a huge difference. It says it's a powerful steam in only 30 seconds. 
Um, I love the design of it. It is more like a little bit more heavy duty than the last one I had. So like if your steamer's working, great. But if it's not and you wanna try something different or maybe you're still using like an iron and a board, steaming is just so easy and quick to do. So definitely give this one a try. It comes with like all sorts of attachments. I don't know if I'll use them. I'll have to read on them. But I did just wanna share this. So if you're in the market for a good steamer, I have used it. It works great. A lot of the dance moms have them in their bag. So now this will be going in mine as well. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I hope it was helpful. I hope you found some products that can make your life a little bit easier. Do not forget about Prime Day that's happening right now. I have that special link down below in my description box. Some of the items I talked about today may or may not be on sale, but everything within that link will be on sale and we will be updating it as today goes and tomorrow. So keep checking it out. And then don't forget to follow Chase and myself over on Instagram, we're going to be doing Amazon gift card giveaways. So if you want to win that, so you can buy some of your prime deals, definitely check that out as well. But I hope you guys have a wonderful week and I will see you in the next one. Bye.